Hello and a very warm welcome to Maths Plus. Today we have a new challenge. We have 3x to the 9th root is equal to x to the 6th root and we're solving for x. So if you're new to the channel, maybe pause the video and give it a try and let me know how you get on. Also, don't forget to subscribe and give a thumbs up. I really appreciate that. Thank you. So let's get started. So we're going to convert the root to a reciprocal power. So we're going to convert the ninth root to 1 over 9 and the sixth root to 1 over 6. Now that we have this applied, what we need to do is somehow cancel one of these on one of the sides. So in this case, we're going to recall this rule for multiplying exponents. And we can multiply in from an outside power. Okay, and we can, so we need a 9 here to cancel the 9. So we'll have 3x to the power of 1 over 9, all to the power of 9. Now this will provide a cancellation, but we need to keep it balanced. So we'll have 1 over 6 to the power of 9 on the right hand side. Now let's recall this formula where we have a fractional root in over m and we can rewrite it as x to the power of n. That's the number we have and that's the root number. So we can go 3x is equal to, so we're going to have the 6 root back again and x to the 9 inside now. All right, so now we're going to apply a split of the 9 into an x to the power of 6 and an x to the power of 3. Now this will help simplify as you can see that we're going to split the third inside now. We have 3x is equal to the 6 root of x to the power of 6 and also a second 6 root then of x to the power of 3. Now we can do some more work with the first one as you can see, the 6 and the 6 root will give us a cancellation and we will just get x there. Okay, so we'll have 3x is equal to x. And then over here again, we're going to put the 3 as the numerator and 6 as the denominator of the power. Perfect. Now let's simplify this even further. Remember, 3 over 6 is the same as 1 over 2 and we know that the x to the power of 1 over 2, you guessed it, that is the square root of x. So now we're making real progress so we have 3x is equal to x square root x. Now let's start solving. So we have it written out here now um, as far as x square root x. So we're going to bring it all over to one side and now we're going to factor out the x and solve. Right, so case one is you can see that x r 3 minus square root x is equal to 0. So for case one x could be equal to 0. Okay, otherwise let's look at case two. And if we set the square root of x bring across the bring across the tree so we get root x is equal to 3 here and if we square both sides we get a cancellation and x is equal to 9 and that's our second result therefore our solution to the maths problem is x is equal to 0 and 9 so thank you very much for watching don't forget to subscribe and like the channel and see you again very soon.